hi guys now welcome to my youtube video and today we're going to talk about social media and how it is a good thing and how is it a bad thing now social media has its pros and it has its cons now when it's a good thing is that you can now use social media as a way to learn a new skill set and you can figure out your problem that you have like a let's say if you want to fix something and you go on YouTube and you type in how to fix my AC, you then can find videos on how to fix something. Now, the bad side of social media is that when we are too addicted to our cell phones and we are just watching content that has no, no reason to really solve a problem, it just gives us entertainment. We then indulge on it too much and the, too much of something is always bad. So you never want to be on social media for too long because social media is going to ruin your life because you will solely depend on social media just for your entertainment when you could be using it to your advantage use it to learn new skills use it to learn how to make money instead of you just being on your phone for 8 to 12 hours out of your day and you're not getting paid because those people that are making the content for you to watch they're the ones that are getting paid so you might as well get paid for the time that you are spending and the good thing about YouTube is it is a platform where you can post your video online for free. People can watch your video and they don't have to pay money to watch your video. But when they do watch your video, they get shown ads and those ads can pay the creator some money so that when they feel as if they are working hard to create the content, they are compensated for their hard work. So that's why you always want to make sure that you are creating content instead of just watching it. And social media nowadays, we are often seeing a lot of people faking it till they make it. And you can fake it till you make it all you want to. But as long as you have a long term plan after you do make it, because if you don't have a long term plan when you don't make it, you're just going to end up throwing it away and you don't want that to happen to you. So always have a long-term plan when you get into social media or just get into anything in general. And people will need to stay motivated while they are making social media content because you can post several hundreds of videos and they won't get any traction, literally. But you have to keep posting your content until it gets traction so that you can always be able to get monetized on social media because that's the best feeling. You can literally get paid in your sleep by just posting YouTube videos and just posting yourself as a person. And you can literally be goofy. You can be serious in your videos. You can just post any kind of videos. You can post vlogs. You can post how-to videos. You can post, you know, get ready with me videos, daily vlogs. You can just literally have fun and just, you know, be yourself as a new creator because people are going to watch your videos because literally everybody is on their cell phones every single day and if you can literally have a following from something that you love to do for the rest of your life youtube is the best way to promote it and when you promote it and you get monetized you will be able to get paid so that means that you don't have to work a nine to five job for someone else that you don't want to work because that is the worst thing you want to work your full-time hobby, your full-time passion, but you can't because you have to work your job because your job has to pay the bills. And it's like you're in a tug-of-war between, oh, man, I don't want to do my job, but I have to do it in order to get paid. Meanwhile, when you are working your passion, your full-time gig that is giving you the happiness that you want, then you'll say, man, I love my job. I love doing this. You know, it doesn't feel like work to me. And it's like you never look at the time when you're working your dream because that's literally a dream that you've worked so hard on. And people see that the hard work is really being pushed out and you can feel the love into what you are doing. So always have passion for something that you want to do, even though it does not seem like it's working out when you first start out. But just keep going for it and just seeing that you can push all the way through. It's a hard battle but you have to win at all times because it will take years for you to see the big results because you have to take it day by day you can't skip no days you can't because all it takes is one person to give you a shout out all it takes is one room that can, you can connect to that can literally change your whole entire life but you have to keep 
knocking on doors. You have to keep putting yourselves there. Be aware of your surroundings because sometimes your surroundings will literally make or break you. So don't try and be someone you're not because when you do that, you eventually, the the, ma the mask will come off your face just like Scooby-Doo. When they normally get caught, they take the mask off because you got caught. So just keep chasing your dreams. Like Social media is a big part of our lives and it will always be a part of our lives because everyone is on their phone 24-7, you know, and we use our phones to distract us and we can't use it to distract us from the life that we live. And it's like, why be addicted to your phone when you could be addicted to be a content creator and you can make so much impact through the world, through your content, through your storytelling, through just you having fun in the life that you want. Like, everybody could have the life that they want. They just have to work for it. It's like, you mean to tell me that if I post every single day and eventually that somebody will relate to my content that I can have the life that I want? Of course, I'll take that any day over a job that doesn't care about me, a job that doesn't see any value in me. So I'm going to take the hard route either way. I love it when it's hard because if it's too easy for me, then it doesn't seem like it's work. You know, it doesn't seem like Nothing is going to change if it's easy. So you might as well just go for the hard route anyway. But you need to create content and just have fun doing it. Don't worry about, oh, I don't have the biggest camera. I don't have the most HD quality or I don't have the biggest, you know, new phone. And don't worry about all that stuff. Just worry about how you are going to actually post your content. All, all you need is a cell phone and Wi-Fi connectivity so that you can post your content through the internet. That's all you need. You don't need anything else. And you literally could do what any type of video that you want. And you want to get paid doing it. Like now is the time to get money in your sleep. If you get paid in your sleep, you'll never have to work a day in your life. Because that is the best money that you'll ever make in your life. When you don't have to work while you're awake. Like you don't have to wake up force yourself to get ready and then have to rush and then go to work go to you know a job you don't like and then go through traffic to get there and get home you know you can just be yourself and be you know human like your job sometimes it won't even see if you're okay or not they just be like oh he's alive so he's just working meanwhile you could be going through stuff at home that could be you know tearing you apart mentally physically and you won't even know and then when the day comes to where, you know, it all goes bad for you, what are you going to do? Who are you going to turn to? You can't turn to nobody because nobody cares about you at your job. But when you're working on yourself, you are full of life. You're full of health. You know, you're fully rested. You can eat whatever you want to eat. You're making the money that you want so that you can literally take care of yourself, take care of your bills, take care of your family. You can have so much responsibility and still have money left over to take care of those things, you know. I always work 24-7 on my dreams as much as I can because I have to do this. This is life-changing opportunity that I have to take, so I'm going to take the opportunity to change my life. This is why I'm so motivated every day. I'm dedicated to it, and I know it's going to happen, so I have to keep going. Even if I don't see any views, I don't see any success, you know, I have to keep working every day at it. You know, I'm always going in the right direction, not in the left. I'm not just going to be blind to the fact that I'm working a job and I'm just going to work there for money. I don't even like working for money anymore because the money I get doesn't even cut it anymore. Like, I get it, it's gone by Friday, and then I got to wait till next Friday again to get paid. And I'm like, what sense is that? It makes no sense for me, so I'm just going to keep doing what I'm doing. Eventually, I'm going to start my clothing brand. Eventually, I'm going to do my lemonade business again. But once I am monetized, I am literally quitting my job and I'm going all in into whatever I believe in, whatever my idea is, going for it. You know, no one's going to stop me. No one's going to tell me otherwise. You can't trick me out of my dreams because my dreams is already set in stone and I've already written it down. I have it plain and I see my dreams every single day. Even when I go to sleep, I see my dreams. Literally, I have my dreams on my iPhone wallpaper, so I'm not stopping for anything. But you just have to have that same mindset when you're chasing your dreams. But social media, man, that's the best way. Like, once you have a thousand subs and you have a certain hours of watch time, you can literally get paid. And you can sign up for the Google AdSense. And once you get that, you know, sign up sheet, you're all good to go. 
And then when you reach over 100,000 subscribers, you can now get a plaque, like a silver plaque. And if you get a, a million subs, you can get a gold plaque, which is crazy, you know. So you want to have those awards that you could just hang up on the wall of your hard work and dedication. Because when you are working a job, you could work your tail off to the point where you don't have one anymore. But they're not going to recognize your hard work. Why? Because they all get paid the same. They all get paid the same. So it's like, why would I recognize you if we both get paid the same? So it's like, you might as well just work for yourself and work as hard. Because people at work, they don't work harder because they're like, oh, I don't get paid much. So why would I work hard? You know, you have to work harder on, your, on yourself than you do your job. Because you're just going to be stuck at your job and you're going to be like, oh, when am I going to leave? You know, I was at a point where I was at Adidas and I was just so stuck there because I didn't know another way out. But now I have a way out through YouTube social media content because everybody watches content, whether it's informational, whether it's entertainment or whether it's empowering. So you just have to watch those type of videos and just try and recreate those same videos. But yeah, that is my TED talk for today. Just social media is so important. Now is the time to get into actually chase your dreams. So feel free to actually start creating content. Doesn't matter how it bad it is right now at least post so that you can get in the game and get in the flow of things but you got this stay motivated and i can't wait to see you on the next video thank you for watching and have a good one let's go